president is with the first lady in private, having personal private time. Vince and Millie. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, you're saying the president is off with his wife, with Millie, mm -hmm. for a quick game? They didn't say how long they'd be, sir. I don't see what the problem is. It's the same plan as always. Fitz and I hold hands and smile at Oprah or Barbara Walters. We do what we always do, act happy. And we just deny it. Deny you. That would have worked before. Before what? Before you got the bright idea to go on national television and tell the world I cheated on you. You did cheat on me. That's not the point. It's exactly the point. Not if you want to smile at Oprah. I wouldn't need to smile at Oprah if you didn't screw your whore every chance you got. Millie, I know the situation is difficult. I do, and I'm so, so sorry. But we have a job to do here, and in order for me to do my part effectively, I'm going to need you to refrain from referring to me as a whore. At least in front of my face. All right? Now, Melly's already told the world you had an affair with someone, and my name has been leaked, so I'm now the public face of that someone. I don't know, we've got to figure out a way to change the narrative, or... We claim the narrative. We tell the truth. We're looking for a way out. Why aren't we looking for a way through? Why don't we just stand up and tell the truth? Melly and I face the press, say yes. I cheated. I slept with Olivia Pope. I had an affair. <laughs> Liv? I'm thinking... You and Melly do a statement in the press room, no, in the Rose Garden. Full press, no questions. You hold hands. Melly wears a soft color, lavender or light blue. You bring in the kids from boarding school, but you don't have them with you for the statement. That always looks staged. The kids look like pawns and the parents seem opportunistic. But the photo up after of you both meeting Jerry and Karen as they step off the chopper, that's Kennedy. Perfect, especially if baby Teddy is running on the grass beside you. The next day, you do one sit down, a full tell all. I'd go with James. He did the Melly interview. The public will like the story of seeing him talking to both of you now. They like knowing that he's a family friend, plus Cyrus can control him. Twelve hours before your sit down with James, I'll release a paper statement. I regret my affair. I've apologized to Melly. I've prayed, blah, 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 trying to put the whole thing behind me, etc. Barring any kind of special prosecutor probe into whether or not I was given any favors because of the relationship, the whole thing should be put to bed well before the primary elections are over. It works. The truth works. The irony. <laughs>